Well, you let those kids die. It's disgusting. It's despicable. And I hope that lives with you for the rest of your life. You had the chance to save those kids. You were the one with the job. You were supposed to do it, and you didn't. Can you explain to me why I let 17 people die at school? 14 kids, 17 years old, stood outside with a gun. Did absolutely nothing. That was your job. Now you're getting paid 80k a year to stand there. Well, you let those kids die. It's disgusting. It's despicable. And I hope that lives with you for the rest of your life. You had the chance to save those kids. You were the one with the job. You were supposed to do it, and you didn't. One year ago, 17 kids were killed in that school. And nothing has changed security-wise. The school is still unsafe, and the school board members and the superintendent, who are a large part responsible for the shooting occurring, have still not been held accountable. I don't know, I don't know how you live with yourself every day, man. You're the one that's supposed to go inside. Going You're down. Oh. Okay. All right, okay. You guys there that day? There's a student there, in the building right next to it. And uh, 14 away classmates, down. never coming back, because you didn't act. I mean, I talked to senators and I looked at all the facts, and they all point in the same direction, that a ban on assault weapons will not solve this issue. It's simply a... Um, and it's simply restrictions on high capacity magazines. That won't solve the issue. Forcing the regulation that's currently in law, I mean, we've seen on so many different levels that the cowards of Broward failed, the FBI failed, Sheriff Scott Israel failed. So many different multi-layered levels failed in Parkland. Kyle Kashev was there that day at Parkland. He's a survivor of the shooting. He's a high school student in Parkland. He says he was recently called in for questioning by school officials for daring to go to a gun range with his dad. It was an interrogation. It was, it was a clear attempt to intimidate me. And they used very, very, very harsh intimidation tactics. I mean, at the end of the day, I went shooting with my dad at a gun range. I mean, I did everything peacefully. Um, and I went shooting with my dad, and I, I did absolutely nothing wrong. They were just saying mean things about Kyle. He did say he was the Hitler type. I don't really know what that means exactly, but I think he was just being crazy. Kashev wasn't present there during, during the rant. He said, my grandfather was one of the only survivors of the Holocaust out of his entire family, and now a teacher is calling me the next Hitler because I have a different political view? Sad. It absolutely nothing. That was your job. Now you're getting paid 80k a year to stand there. Well, you let those kids die. It's disgusting. It's despicable. And I hope that lives with you for the rest of your life. You had the chance to save those kids. You were the one with the job. You were supposed to do it, and you didn't.